Welcome to the creating multi-select questions in the question library demo. In this demo, you will learn how to create a multi-select style question, meaning that the student may choose more than one answer to be correct. At the end of this demo, you will be able to create a multi-select style question in your question library for use in your assessments. First, log in to your D2L Brightspace account and go into your course. On the gray course navigation bar, click on the assessments link. Notice the tabs at the top. Manage assessments, question library, and statistics. Click on the question library tab. Now we are going to create new questions in this section. Click on the section name to go into its folder. To create a multi-select question where more than one answer is correct, pick that option from the new drop-down menu. You can leave the title of the question blank. Doing so will make the question text show up as the title. You can leave the points value set to 1. This number can be changed later when you create the assessment. Click in the question text field and enter your statement. If you want to add an image to go along with this question only, click the insert an image button and then click the upload button. Locate the image on your computer, select the image and click open. Once your image is uploaded, click add. For this question, under enumeration, Pick the style you want to use. The common choice is ABCD. For style, you can have the answers show up vertical or horizontal. For grading, you have the options of all or nothing, right minus wrong, or correct answers. If you want the question graded as they either got it right or wrong, use the all or nothing choice. If you want the question graded with partial credit, you will want to use one of the other two options. Correct answers is the most common. If you want the answer choices to be randomized each time the question is loaded, make sure that the randomize options field is checked. Under the value column, enter in the choices that you want to show up for the question. If you need to add more choices, enter the number of choices you need in the Add Option field above the value column and click the green plus sign. Under the Correct column, check the boxes for the right answers. If you wish to give feedback at the end of the assessment, you may enter in the feedback next to each choice. If at any point you would like to see what your question will look like, you can select the preview button at the bottom. Once you have finished previewing the question, select Done to go back to the edit screen. When you are finished making changes, click the Save button in the bottom left corner and you will return to the section list. If you want to create another question very similar to this one, click on the Save and Copy button. That will save this question and create another one with all of this question's information so that you can just edit this question's information instead of retyping it. If you want to create another question of this same type, click on the Save and New button. That will save this question and give you a new blank question of this question type. You have now successfully created a multi-select question in the question library.